there's, as with anything, there's a couple of different ways that you could do it. Uh, if there's a specific uninstaller or uh, remediation that you can run, you know, something that comes from VLC that says, you know, run this PowerShell script or, you know, install, uh, you know, download and run this uninstaller. Um, you can do that with Automation Manager. But I believe, if I'm not mistaken, what we can do is actually add a, uh, a specific task to, mm, 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 um, do, 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 where did it go? Oh, yeah, so install slash remove software. So um, if we want to uninstall uh, an already installed application, uh, that is assuming it was installed through, um, uh, I can't remember what this uh, acronym is, but the, the Microsoft uh, installer standard, um, that can be removed um, using uh, basically just triggering the uh, the Windows uninstaller for that uh, uh, you know for that app. Uh, if there is an uninstaller for it that you can get from uh, you know from a particular URL, uh, you know if there's a, a double click to uninstall VLC kind of uh, app or um, you know a, a removal tool or whatever to download. Um, you can do that with, uh, you know, either putting it on, uh, putting the uninstaller on one of your servers and just go and grabbing it, grabbing it from the file system, or um, running it from uh, a URL. So this says this says install software, but it will basically download and run the installer. Uh, and if the installer is an uninstaller, it'll run that too. So um, that will work as a um, uh, uh, as a fix if the uh, uninstall directly. Uh, via MSI does not work. Um, there's also, if you want to, um, da, 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 da. Mm -hmm. let's see, where did it go? I want to say there was a uh, remove, uh, uh, no, it's a local profile. I, there, there should be a way to basically find a folder and then just delete the folder, uh, you know, specifically the installation folder or the, um, you know, the preferences folder for a, uh, for a particular, uh, you know, remove it, you know, remove that path uh, from the machine. So you just go in and, you know, delete star dot star or, you know, VLC slash star dot star or whatever. Um, and I, I know that there's a way to do that with automation manager. I want to say there was one as a, um, uh, uh, a task as well. Uh, I'm not super familiar with where some of those um, those kind of things uh, exist in here. But the um, uh, your best bet is to find either an uninstaller or use the uninstall uh, feature uh, in Windows to do that. <clears throat> 